Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome to my channel. My name is Brie, and this week's video, as you can tell by this giant pile next to me, we are going to be doing a Once Upon a Child haul. Um, Mama went a little crazy, did a lot of shopping recently, uh, so I wanted to share with you what all we got for my ever-growing little man. He is currently in a zero to three month, so I got a couple of things that'll fit him now. However, everything that I got is like three to six and up so that I can start building those bigger sizes. So without further ado, let's get into it. So I actually went to Once Upon a Child three different times over the last like week and a half. <laughs> uh, there's a few locations near me. So I visited one of them twice and the other one just once. I did get a couple of non-clothing items, so I'm just going to talk about those real quick. The first one is a formula separator. So as I mentioned in my labor and delivery story, we are a breastfeeding duo. However, when I'm at work, we do add in some combo feeding with formula and he is starting to get full formula bottles with that. So I wanted to have a divided storage container for on the go. Another big thing that we purchased that is non-clothing is a high chair. So I found a Graco high chair, which I'll put up on the screen here, a picture of it. I found a Graco high chair for $45, which Graco high chairs are normally over a hundred. So definitely wanted to snatch that up. He's not going to use it until he's about six to seven months old when we start with purees and um, introducing him to foods, but can't pass up a good deal like that. Now we're going to talk about the clothing. So like I said, most of this is three to six months and up, but there are a couple of zero to three items in here. So first off, we have these cute little jeans. These are a zero to three and these ones are by Carter's. They got a little waist, uh, sweatpant waistband here. He's actually already worn these and I paired it with this cute little flannel hoodie. Also a zero to three month. And I will put a picture on the screen of how adorable he looked in this outfit. The only thing that would have made it better would be a little pair of chucks but his pair of them don't fit him yet. So, anyways. And the next couple things we got are also zero to three months. These are just another pair of jeans. These ones also have the elastic waistband, but they are from Granimals. I got him this cute little onesie from the children's place that says mommy's coffee date, which is very accurate. As you guys know, I love my coffee. And then I got him this one that says Mommy's Mr. Charming. I got a lot of onesies that say like Mommy's Little Man, Mommy's whatever. So you'll notice a trend. The next like stack of items I've got here go into that three to six and up range. So this one is actually a six to nine. It's a little onesie that's got a dinosaur on it and it says mommy's cutosaurus i just thought this dinosaur was so cute and one of my best friends sent us a dinosaur that looks just like this that says that sings lullabies so i thought that was adorable next up this little onesie that's got some doggies on it and it's got a little pocket and if you didn't know um about Carter, or not Carter's, about Once Upon a Child, they do a 10 for 10 onesie deal where you can get 10 bodysuits slash onesies for $10. So that's what I did, just so I could stock up his uh, onesie collection and like the basics. Got this black and white striped one. This is a three to six month, I believe. Yeah, three to six months. <laughs> Just a plain blue one. I like this almost like distressed kind of worn in material. He had a pair of pants like that when he was a newborn. This onesie that says mommy's tough guy. I'm actually thinking about putting this on him next week when he goes in for his first round of shots because I think he's gonna be tougher than I am. 
I got him this just plain red onesie because the basics are always a good idea to have. I can layer them. You can wear them just as is. Always good to have those. And then because I call him my little man, we have this onesie that says mommy's little man. And all of these onesies have been uh, three to six months. I realize I didn't say that. So now we have a couple of little outfits. I am obsessed with these little rompers. So he's got this one, it's yellow, and it's got some little elephants all over it, little pocket and everything. And my brother actually helped pick that one out. Got him this green romper. And on this little thing here, it says Mommy's Little Explorer. I don't know if it's gonna focus on it. Oh, there it goes. And I just thought this was so cute, the little cargo shorts and everything. I'm obsessed with it. And then the thing that I'm probably most excited about, I got him his first swimsuit. This is a three to six month and it's one of the little rash guard rompers. I love these for babies because they're so much easier. So it has a zipper down the front, but it also has, oh, it doesn't, this one doesn't have buttons. Some of them have buttons on the bottom for easy diaper changes. So this one doesn't, but that's okay. We'll make it work. So moving on, we have this next outfit. This is a little overall set with a red shirt. It's got Harry Potter symbols all over it. And this is a three to six month. Yeah. So he'll be able to wear this this like spring, summer. And I'm really excited about it because these are like almost sweatpant type material, but they're really thin, which is nice. Then we've got a 12 month item. I got him this cute little Mickey Mouse button up and I can't wait to pair this with just like some shorts and some sneakers. This will definitely be closer to his one month, his one month, his one year birthday. So his one year birthday, his first birthday. I can't speak, but I saw it and I had to get it. Even though it's a 12 month, always good to have those bigger sizes. So some more onesies because I couldn't help myself. And this gray one with some polar bears on it. Now this is by Carter's, but I like to think that it is Coca-Cola bears just because. And this is a six to nine month, so a little bit bigger. And then following the Harry Potter trend and this one. My neighbors are being really loud as you can hear. I got this little one that says Little Wizard because we love Harry Potter in this house. And then moving right along, we've got some more simple ones, a green one with some dinosaurs on it. I wasn't completely on board with having a bunch of dinosaur printed stuff just because I'm a boy mom, but now I'm coming around to it because I really like dinosaurs. So we've got this yellow and navy striped one. This cute little sloth and whales and like bears onesie. Just some more basics. This one is a brand new Carter's onesie. Like it still has stickers and tags and everything on it. So like brand new. That tag just fell off though. And it has a little doggy and a turtle. It's just a light blue striped. I really like it. And then to start his superhero collection, we've got Captain America. We've got some Marvel, but we also have DC. My cape is in the wash. I just thought this was so cute. And just like, I liked this take on the Batman onesie versus like, just a black and yellow onesie. We have this onesie that says Mommy's Little Explorer. Like I said, tons of like Mommy's Little whatever uh, because that's a lot of what you find for little boys is like Mommy's Little Boy. And most of the like dad related stuff is like dad's all star, dad's little champ, dad's sport. And like we're not a huge sports family so it wouldn't really fit with us. However, I did find this one. It's daddy's little buddy. 
and his dad calls him buddy all the time so I thought this was perfect we got a couple of pajamas so I got this one that's like a sea foamy green and navy and it does not have footies because he's starting to use sleep sacks a little bit so this will be nice for that and then I found this footy pajama that is actually by Converse, which I thought was really cool. So it's this navy blue and it's got little Converse all over it. But the best part is that on the feet, there's like the no slip grips. I don't know if it's gonna focus on them. And I kind of wish they had had this in like a 12 month because then, you know, theoretically that's when he'll be walking and he'll need the no slip grips. But it's a six, uh, six to nine month, I think. Oh, it says three to six, but the tag says six months, so we'll see. Now, on my final trip to Once Upon a Child, I did a couple of different deals. So I'm gonna show you the non clearancey stuff, and then I'll show you the sale that I was able to find. So a couple of zero to three month items that I found. I had this cute little Mickey Mouse set. So it's this gray onesie with Mickey Mouse, kind of that classic setup. And then these little basketball shorts that say Mickey Mouse on them. So I just thought that was adorable and he can wear that for in the next couple weeks. If we go to Disney or anything, he can wear that. And obviously his first trip to Disney, I will bring you guys along as well. And then because on his first trip to Disney, I know we're gonna visit my old location, we're gonna visit the jungle, I set up this cute little outfit for him. It's these khaki overalls with jungle animals on them. And then just a white polo um, onesie, just to layer it. Because I like the idea of the polo with these more than just like a plain white onesie. But he's got two outfits for his first trip to Disney because Florida weather is ridiculous. And then keeping up with the Disney trend, this is a six to nine month, so it'll fit him later this year, but it's a long sleeve and it, baby Yoda, come to the cute side. And he has this onesie in zero to three month, but I love it and I was so glad to find it. It's by Cat and Jack and it's so little, so loved, so happy. This was actually the first onesie that I bought when I found out I was pregnant because I used it to tell my siblings that I was gonna have a baby. So I just thought it was cute. And then, like I mentioned, he is starting to transition over to sleep sacks right now versus his swaddle, which is a work in progress. But I found one sleep sack from Advent Health, well, actually my friend that I went shopping with, went that i went with found a sleep sack slash swaddle i'll put a picture up here of what i mean kind of like the halo sleep sacks um, from advent health and it is a sleep sack with a little swaddle that goes over it he's currently wearing it to calm him down for bed so i will get a picture of it and put it up here so you guys can see what I'm talking about. So that has been a lifesaver. But I also found just your traditional sleep sack with no sleeves and everything. This has hedgehogs on it. He has a long sleeve one like this that is fleece and he likes it, but I think it's a little too hot. So this one being thinner and being more of a, like a cottony material, I think he's gonna like this one for like summertime. So. I think that'll be good. So now the final part of this, my local Once Upon a Child was doing a fill a bag sale. So they provided you with a plastic shopping bag for $20. You filled it with as much of these out of these bins that you could find. It was mostly like fall and winter stuff. So like long sleeves, jeans, sweatpants, sweatshirts, stuff like that. But they had sizes newborn to 18 months so I used that to find him some fall slash winter clothes for this coming year. And I got a small stack of them here. And like I said, I tried to go for like the nine month and up because that's what he'll be wearing when it's colder out. So the first thing we got is this little uh, thinner sweatshirt, just kind of a layering sweatshirt that says Little Gentleman's Academy. 
and it's just a nice light gray very light easy to wear for layering and everything and then you'll notice a trend he got a lot of flannels because we love flannels so we have this blue buffalo plaid we have another navy blue one but it has the like sweatshirt sleeves on it i got this one that comes with the little sweater vest and it's attached and i thought this would look so cute with this pair of jeans that i found i actually didn't plan to put these together i found them separately but then when i got home i was like that would be so cute and this is a 12 month so it'll be right around like november december if he grows at a standard rate of you know sizes i found these so wet pants that have mickey mouse on the knee so these are just super cute and easy to throw on with a onesie i found him this button up that is a blue striped with some sailboats and anchors nice fancier onesie and to go along with that i found this one that is a darker blue stripe with trucks on it same idea though i got him some pajamas nice spider-man pajamas and again these do not have the feet on them so he'll be able to wear them with sleep sack or when he gets a little bit bigger because this is a six to nine. Oh no this is a three to six i thought it was a six to nine well i guess he's gonna wear this sooner than i thought good to know another flannel here just a black and red kind of plaid we have this hooded flannel it's got some blue and orange and gray perfect for the fall time i would say and then finally i got him a slightly thicker jacket this one's from oshkosh bagosh it's got some sweatpant type sleeves and waistband there it's just a nice navy color and it's on the slightly thicker side of a like standard jacket so nice for when it gets a little bit colder and with that my pile has moved from this side over to this side and that concludes this video i hope you all enjoyed and if you want to see more baby hauls or once upon a child videos let me know down in the comments below you can hit that red button to subscribe and see more of my videos if you enjoyed you can find all my socials down below and i will see you guys next sunday bye